Hello, everybody. This is Angie at Cuckoo for Coupons, and this is my CVS haul for the week of May 26th through June 1st. So I did go to CVS today. This is actually Sunday the 26th when I'm recording this, and I did go to CVS, but this video probably will not be posted until late tonight or early in the morning on Monday. So just know that I did my shopping on Sunday. So I ended up doing two transactions in the store and I'll show you both of those transactions and all of the coupons that I used, all of that good stuff. But before I do, if you guys could just take a second and give this video a big thumbs up, I would really appreciate it. And if you haven't done so yet, if you could just take a moment and hit that subscribe button and then ring that notification bell, that way you know when I post my videos, I would be super grateful. Also, if you are new to my channel, welcome. I am so happy to have you here. Please say hello in the comments below. I would love to say hello back. And if you've been here all along watching my videos, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Don't forget, I will have a printable breakdown below the video of everything that I got in the store today. So you can just print that out and take it to the store with you. It is going to make your shopping so much easier. All right, let's go ahead and get into my CVS haul. Okay, so for my first transaction, I am going to be using this 10 off of 70 spend threshold CRT. So that means I need to get $70 in items before any manufacturer coupons. If you don't know how to get one of these 10 off of 70 spend threshold CRTs or any kind of spend threshold CRT, I did make a video showing you exactly how to do it I will have it linked below this video in the description box. So definitely check that out if you haven't been getting any of these CRTs because there's a whole new way of doing it now. So let me go ahead and show you the items I grabbed so that I could use the spend threshold CRT. Okay, so the first couple of items I'm gonna grab are two of these Sally Hansen Extreme Wear Nail Polish. So these are priced $4.99 in my store. And they are part of a deal where if you spend $10 on Sally Hansen Cosmetics, you're going to get a $4 extra buck back. So grabbing two of these at $4.99 each, that is a total of $9.98 for both. And my store does follow the 98% rule, which means as long as you spend more than 98% of that $10, or whatever the amount may be, you're still going to get the extra buck back. So I am good to go. I'll still get the extra buck back. I do have this $3 mystery offer CRT on the Sally Hansen Cosmetics that we all should have gotten today. So I'm going to go ahead and use that. And then I also have this $2 off of one digital coupon for the Sally Hansen. However, this coupon does expire today. So it is the last day to use it. So after both of those come off, my total is going to be $4.98 for both. But then I'm going to get back a $4 extra buck, making the final cost just $0.98 cents for both or only $0.49 cents each. Next up, I'm going to grab a couple of the Crest toothpaste that is on sale for $3.99. They are also buy two and get back a $4 extra buck. So grabbing two of them at $3.99 each, that is a total of $7.98 for both. I have this $2 off of two digital coupon that we all should have gotten today. Plus, I have this $2 off of one digital that will also come off. So that is going to make both of them $3.98. But then I'm going to get back a $4 extra buck which is going to make both of them free plus a two cent moneymaker. But then I'm going to take my receipt and submit it to Ibotta for $2 cash back on one of them because it is a limit of one. I've already maxed out mine on my Ibotta account. So I'm going to submit this on my son's account for $2 back. So that is going to make both of the toothpastes free plus a $2 and two cent moneymaker. Next up, I am going to grab a couple of these OGX hair treatments. So these are all priced $10.49, and they are buy one, get one 50% off. They're not tagged, but that is what they are. And they're also 
buy two and earn a $4 extra buck. So I am going to grab one of the argon oil mist, and then I'm going to grab one of the coconut milk serum. So the first one is going to be $10.49. The second is going to ring up at $5.24. That is a total of $15.73 for both. But I do have this four off of two digital coupon that is going to bring them down to $11.73 for both. And then I'm going to get back the $4 extra buck, making them $7.73 for both. But then I'm going to take my receipt and submit it to Ibotta. This time I'll do it on my account for $2.50 cash back. It is a limit of one. So I'm only going to get the $2.50 back. So both of these items are going to end up being just $5.23 or only $2.61 each. This Ibotta rebate though did have only one day left when I did this deal. So definitely check your Ibotta to see if it's still available before deciding to do the deal. Next up, we have a moneymaker deal on the CoverGirl Cosmetics. So the CoverGirl Cosmetics are buy three and get back a $10 extra buck. So I am going to grab one of these CoverGirl Outlast Moisturizing Lip Top Coats. These are only $5.19 in my store and there was only one left, so I snagged it. And then I'm also going to grab two of the CoverGirl Perfect Blend Eye Pencils. My store does not have any of the brow pencils right now, the two packs. So I'm going to go with these. These are priced $6.29 each. So all three of the cosmetics together total $17.77. So we all should have gotten this $5 off of one CoverGirl product digital coupon. So I'm going to use that on the CoverGirl Outlast lip product. And then for the eye products, I'm going to use two of these $3 printable coupons. I got these from coupons.com. And I did print these today. So hopefully they're still available to print. But after all three of those coupons come off, I'm going to be at $6.77 for all three, but then I'm going to get back a $10 extra buck, making all three of them free plus a $3.23 moneymaker, which is amazing. But also, if you can grab those moneymaker deals, you definitely should always grab them. So if you can do this deal, do it because that moneymaker helps cover the cost of some of the other items we have to pay a little bit for. So always try to grab those money makers, even if you don't need the product, because it really does help out in the end. And you can always donate the product or give it away or whatever you need to do, but definitely grab them if you can. Next up, I am going to grab a couple of the L'Oreal L-Vibe shampoo and conditioner. So these are on sale two for $10. And they're also buy two and get back a $3 extra buck. So grabbing two of them for $10, we do have a three off of two digital coupon. So that is going to bring them down to $7 for two. You'll get back that $3 extra buck. And that is going to make them just $4 for two or only $2 each. So I am going to grab these. And then the last couple of items I'm going to grab for this transaction are some of these Maybelline Baby Lips. So these are priced $5.79 in my store, and I am going to grab two of them because the Maybelline Cosmetics are buy two and get back a $6 extra buck. So grabbing two of them at $5.79 each that is a total of $11.58 for both. I still have this $3 mystery offer CRT. We actually got this last week and it did extend into this week for me for one day. So it does expire at the end of the day, but I'm going to go ahead and use that. And then we all should have gotten this $3 off of one digital coupon that did show up in our accounts today. 
So I'm gonna use both of those. That is gonna bring them both down to $5.58, but then I'm gonna get back a $6 extra buck, making both of them free plus a 42 cent moneymaker. Okay, so this is everything I'm grabbing for my first transaction. I'm gonna take all of this and I'm gonna to head to the register and I'm gonna make sure I use that 10 off of 70 spend threshold CRT. Okay, so here is my receipt. I'm just gonna go over all of the coupons that applied, but everything did ring up as it should. So I had the $2 digital for the Sally Hansen. I had a two off of two digital for the Crest, a $4 off of two for the OGX, my $5 off of one for the CoverGirl did come off, my $3 off of one for the Maybelline, and then my other crest, it was a $2 off of one, did also come off. I also used my 10 off of 70 spend threshold CRT. I had the $3 mystery offer CRT that I still had from last week for the Maybelline come off. And then my $3 mystery offer for the Sally Hansen from this week came off as well. And then if you look all the way at the bottom, there is a $3 manufacturer coupon and a $3 CVS coupon. Those are actually my two printable $3 CoverGirl coupons. I don't know why one says manufacturer and one says CVS, but for some reason I went to self-checkout and they would not scan. There was nothing wrong with them. They just wouldn't actually scan on the scanner. So the cashier came over and he ended up just typing them in for me. So that is why they're at the bottom like that. And again, I don't know why one says one thing and one is the other, but those are my two $3 printable coupons. I also rolled $28 in extra bucks into this transaction. And my subtotal ended up being just $1.93. So that is what I paid out of pocket. But if we add the $28 in extra bucks that I used to that, I technically paid $29.93 for all 13 of these items. I then got back a $4 extra buck for buying the two Crest, a $3 extra buck for buying the two L'Oreal L-Vive, a $6 extra buck for buying the two Maybelline, a $4 extra buck for the two OGX, a $4 extra buck for spending 10 on the Sally Hansen, and then a $10 extra buck for buying three of the CoverGirl. I then submitted my receipt to my son's account for $2 back on the Crest, and then on my own account for $2.50 on the OGX. So in the end, for all of these items, I got them all for free plus a $5.57 moneymaker. And I think that is an amazing deal. So I did do one more transaction. It's a very simple transaction. I only grabbed two items. And those items were these Dove whole body deodorants. So I grabbed one of the cream and then one of the stick. So these are $12.99, but they are buy one, get one 50% off. There is no extra buck deal or anything like that. I'm just simply gonna grab one of each. The first one is gonna be $12.99, and the second one at 50% off is gonna be $6.49. So that is a total of $19 and 48 cents for both. I do have this 10 off of two digital coupon, so I am gonna use that. And then I have this five off of 15 Dove deodorant CRT. So I'm gonna use that as well. So after both of those come off, I am gonna be at $4.48 for both, but then I'm gonna take my receipt and I'm gonna submit it to Fetch Rewards because I have $3 back and it can be redeemed up to five times. So I'm gonna get $3 back twice for a total of $6, but I also have $2 back on Fetch Rewards that can also be redeemed up to five times. So for this one, 
I am going to get $4 back from Fetch Rewards. So I'm going to get $6 and $4 for a total of $10 all together from Fetch Rewards. So that is going to make both of these free plus a $5.52 moneymaker, which is an awesome deal. And here is my receipt. So they did ring up buy one, get one 50% off. I used that 10 off of two digital coupon, and then I used that five off of 15 CRT. My subtotal was $4.48. I just went ahead and paid that, but you can always roll an extra buck if you want to. And then I did take my receipt and I submitted it to Fetch Rewards, and I did get $10 back. So in the end, both of these items did end up being free plus a $5.52 moneymaker. And here is everything that I got at CVS today. I ended up getting 15 items all together. My first transaction was free plus a $5.57 moneymaker. And my second transaction was also free plus a $5.52 moneymaker. So in the end... All of these items were free plus an $11.09 moneymaker. So I could not be happier. And that is it. That is everything I got in my CVS haul. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure you give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't done so yet, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It would really help out my channel. As always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and good luck couponing.